Hey guys, how you doing? My name is Robbie, and today's video is sponsored by me. It's sponsored by my merch. Yay! Did you guys know that I have warm, cozy sweaters like this Peace Love Wi-Fi sweater? Nope. No? Well, how about, did you know that it also comes in a shirt? Nope. You didn't know that either? What about, one second. Did you know about my Robbie Epic Sauce cartoon t-shirt? Nope. nope. No? What? How about, uh, how about this off dad t-shirt? What? You don't like profanity? Then I have a better option for you then. How about this pizza shirt? This seems pretty cool, right? Nope. Oh, you want more pizza t-shirts? I got more. Oh man, now that's what I'm talking about. The Robbie all over pizza pizza. <laughs> This is the shirt that I wear in every single video. It's my Pizza Pixel shirt. This is actually part of my merch, if you guys didn't know that. And I got one more for you guys. Isn't that so cute? And one more thing while I still have you here. I also sell stickers! Anyway, link to all the stuff down description down below. I'm gonna continue with the actual video now. I will see you guys in a sec. Hey guys, how you doing? My name is Robbie, and today we're gonna be doing a bunch of fun, delicious cooking hacks. Wait, what is this video even called? 20 Crazy But Delicious Cooking Hacks by 5 Minute Crafts. Let's do this! Yeah, I should really learn how to actually play guitar sometime. Okay, so this one's a little bit of a doozy. I don't have a mixing bowl, so I'm just gonna use this pot that I have. Here's a heavy whipping cream. And the only activated charcoal I could find was in this pill form. It's gonna be a little bit weird because they're in capsules, so I have to bust them open. <laughs> and then, of course, we can't forget our sugar. I don't have one of those fancy automatic blending whiskers like they have in the video, but I have a regular whisk and a drill. So maybe I could make some work out of this. Okay, maybe put that, no. Oh, I have an idea. Holy sh it broke my saw. I just gotta fix this really quick. Great, now I'm getting metal shards everywhere. There we go. Don't need that anymore. Will that fit in here now? Aha! I did it! Yeah, I think that'll do. Wipe away all the metal shards. We go ahead and add our heavy whipping cream. They didn't say exactly how much to add. Same thing with the sugar. I don't exactly know how much to add to this, but I guess I'll just put a fuck ton because sugar is delicious and awful for you. Wow, that is very heavy cream. Now we're gonna bust open some capsules, I guess. This is so odd. What even is this stuff? It literally doesn't taste like anything. This bottle was also very expensive. This was like $8. I'm not sure how much I'm supposed to add, but I think this should be enough. Okay, now it's time for us to try our contract. It's working pretty good. Oh man, please don't get everywhere. Yeah, I definitely don't think that this is enough charcoal. A few more pallets. Give us a little mix. Okay, it still doesn't look as dark as the video, so we're gonna go ahead and add even more activated charcoal. My hands are getting so dark. What does activated charcoal even do? Is this like safe to eat? Okay, now it's time for the scary part. Okay. This stuff literally has a warning label on it not to touch it. You know how hard this shit is to find? I had to go to four different stores just to find dry ice. Apparently you're supposed to crumble it up. I'm kind of scared of this stuff. We'll get a scoop of this and put it in there. Oh man, it's boiling. Oh wow, what even is going on with this? Like how would you even measure this? Now we're gonna go ahead and mix this up. What even is going on here? It looks like I'm making fucking magic. It's like a boiling cauldron or something. This is getting everywhere. Can you die by eating dry ice? This is definitely looking a lot like ice cream now. I'm gonna go ahead and Google really quick and see if you can eat dry ice. Making ice cream with dry ice. Oh, so this is actually a thing. Okay, so after this it says I'm supposed to put it in the freezer and let it sit for a sec. And uh, into the freezer you go. Now I gotta worry about this mess. Perfect, we're all good. Okay, scary ice cream. I hope you're all done. Oh God. Okay. Stay. Okay, hopefully this isn't dangerous anymore. Wow, it's almost like normal ice cream. I am great at scooping ice cream, I'll tell you what. Comparison test, this is theirs and this is mine. Okay, now uh, let's see how it tastes. Okay, this looks pretty good. That's actually pretty good. This is some of the best ice cream I've actually ever had. I don't think I've ever had fresh ice cream like this before. Tori, get down here and try some of this delicious cream. Oh my God, Robbie. I know, I got it you everywhere. You got it everywhere. I know. Is it Tori Dabransky approved? It is Tori Dabransky approved. Woo! Okay guys, so we got our orange, we got our knife, 
Go ahead and cut some of this off. Here's our balloon. Oh boy, I don't like the sound of popping balloons. Oh god, why isn't it popping? It's not working, what the heck? I wonder what's up with that. Just gonna rub it all on there. <laughs> why isn't it working? Let me put the whole orange peel on there. What the heck? I don't know what's going on with this. Why isn't it working? I'm gonna go get a fresh balloon and see what happens. Okay, so we got our balloon, we got our orange peel. Oh boy, here we go. Oh my god, it worked. Oh my god. It works. Oh my god, I'm shaking. It works, guys. <laughs> Okay, so this one looks easy. We got our Coke, we got our milk. Now we just gotta put our milk in our Coke. This seems like such a waste of milk and Coke. No, 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 no. Why are you imploding? Why are you imploding? I'm gonna go ahead and rip this off. I'll see you guys in a couple minutes. Okay, I feel like th it's been long enough. Um, let's see how this smells. I feel like it's not gonna smell that great. It smells kind of like a root beer float. Should I taste it? I mean, it's just milk and Coke. What, what could go wrong? That was kind of gross. But it worked! Okay, so cutting board. Then we grab our apple and turn them into little spears. Gather these up a little bit. That always happens when I do that. And I wasn't sure what kind of dough I was supposed to use, so I just bought pizza crust, because let's face it, pizza is the best food in the world. I'm not 100% sure how to open this. I think like that. Peel and press spoon here. Okay, that works. Get out of here, apples. So apparently then I'm supposed to make two even strips, kind of like this. I don't know what I was supposed to do with that. I'm supposed to. I couldn't find one of those flour sifter things, so I just went ahead and bought a sink strainer. I'm sure it'll do the same thing, right? Let me get our powdered sugar here. Pour it all in there. I think that's working. A little bit more. Why not? Okay, I think I might have put a little bit too much. Put some over here just to even it out, I guess. Same thing with this one. Here we go. Then I just go ahead and start rolling it like this, I guess. Oh, no. I don't think this is working like how it's supposed to. Yeah, I'm sure this is fine. Oh, man. I think mine look better, personally. I don't know. Okay, so now I'm going to transfer them onto the oven sheet. Oh, that's gross. That's a hair. Here's the other one. I'll see you guys in 20 minutes. Okay, it's been 20 minutes. I mean, they don't look that much different. Oh boy. Yeah, it's like a, you know, it's special in its own way. Okay guys, now it's time to try these puppies out. I'm gonna go for this one because it looks like it's the most cooked. Um, it's okay. I mean, I'm starving, so it doesn't taste that bad. It's kind of like an apple pie, only the crust isn't really that hard. I mean, it's not that bad. So I guess it works, kinda. Okay, so I got my bag, got my orange juice. I'm using Sunny D, cause Tori said that it doesn't matter if it's orange juice or not. We'll see. <laughs> Open that up. Put it in the bag. I think I might have put too much. I think that should be fine. That should be fine. Then I get my bag of ice. I put the juice stuff in here. I add the salt. I'm just gonna hope that that's enough. <laughs> and then apparently I just mix the fuck out of it. Yep, my bag is leaking. Oh my goodness. Oh my god, I think it's working. Getting all over me. Ah! Okay, gonna open this baby up. What? Oh wait, no, it's, it's just really cold. I think I gotta mix it more. Maybe I need more salt? I don't know. Okay, I'm back with even more ice, and I'm gonna double bag this thing. Now we're gonna put our concoction into this bag. We don't need this one anymore. Now we add our salt to this bag. I'm gonna add a lot this time. I added about half of this thing, so maybe it'll work this time. I'm starting to think I should've went with the more expensive bags. Shake it, shake it, shake it! I think I've been doing that long enough. Let's see if it worked. Oh. No! Way. It actually works. It's frozen. It actually froze. I'm not sure what the science is behind this, but it actually froze. Now I have like Sunny D ice cream. This is so cool. Wow. It actually worked. Wow. I'm impressed. I'm really impressed.
So the first thing you do is you get a proper mug. I kind of like this one. It's metal and uh, it's perfect for the any apocalypse. You get your hot water and you put it in there. Oh no, that's steaming you up. I'm so sorry. Next, we're gonna make our hot cocoa. I'm gonna use the pre-packaged hot cocoa. Uh, mine is most likely gonna have wabs. If you guys don't want wabs, feel free to click on that video. It's a tutorial on how to make some bomb hot chocolate by Yusaki Cooking. Uh, he's a lot funnier than me, so I understand if you guys stop watching me and just start watching him completely. Also, make sure to tell him that Robbie sent you and to thank him for fixing your wabs. Now we're gonna go ahead and mix this up. Take our stencil, put it right there, just like that. Use a little tape to hold that on. Then we're gonna use our sink strainer to sift the powdered sugar in. Maybe this will work. It didn't work at all. I'm gonna go ahead and use some ground cinnamon. Maybe that'll work better. Yeah. Oh, <gasps> it kind of didn't work at all. Man, I'm so good at this. I should just go to barista school, start working at Starbucks, quit my job as a YouTuber. Yep, if you guys don't hear from me after this video, that's what happened. So I feel like I was just too incompetent to make this work. <laughs> okay guys, if you like the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. It looks like I'm at this one right down there. If you guys like this video and you wanna watch more, I have a whole playlist dedicated to me trying stuff from Five Minute Crafts. I have a lot of fun making these videos and you guys seem to love them, so <laughs> I don't know. Make sure to hit that subscribe button if you guys are new. If you guys want this shirt or stickers, I sell them. Click right here or down description down below. Okay guys, I love you so much. I'll see you guys again on Saturday. Peace, love, and Wi-Fi. Awkward Okay, bye! Ah!